It is I. Spirit of nature, paladin of plants, ruler of the rainforest. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> <sighs> It has been quite the journey these last few years, from losing one's watt cards, to ragdolls and mafia, to mini parties and musical numbers. But just as the spring leaves wither in the fall, that same community is fading. It was the dawn of 2019. Many fell from community and many lost faith in it, certain that it would never return to what it once was. Either choice left both these who departed and those who stayed scarred and so often alone. This harbingered the rise of two parties, two dark forces, who rose to press their claim on the community. <clears throat> the Dark Gravel Group, a band of grave lights bent on changing community to their own image, a twisted version of what community used to be. And the Shadow Council, the spirits of those grave lights who left the community hell bent on destroying it once and for all. Both their missions depended on one man spirit of community, who had the power to permanently alter community. We all know him as William. But on one fateful day, the Dark Gravel Group managed to seize control of Will's will through a binding spell, with the only cure being a bite of a lemon. As they approached the altar to realize their goal, they were stopped by the Shadow Council, who sought to kill William and annihilate the spirit of community. Through a violent uproar, Oliver, one of William's roommates and Dark Gravel Group member, turned his back on his ways and gave William but a slice of a lemon though unsure if it was sufficient to remove the binding spell. William and his roommates reigned triumphant over the hordes of dark forces to reach the altar, knowing now that he had the power to change community and rid it of these dark forces forever. They started the ritual. Wait, One where Keith is actually good at music. Ah, oh, uh, top priority. Yeah. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. in University College? <laughs> it's kind of self-centered, don't you think, guys? Guys? Where is everyone? Noah! I haven't seen him since Halloween! <laughs> and have a great prospect. Thanks! Ooga booga! Oh, hi! Welcome to William Luzon University College. Luzon? Don't you mean Lozen? <laughs> um, I think I know how it's pronounced. I've been here for almost five years. You, on the other hand, look pretty new. Wait, so you don't recognize me? Sorry, I haven't had time to memorize the whole faces book. I've been too busy working on this. What is it? Great bingo sheet? Your, Your first, first class, class ticket to a, a fantastic roster. Wait, did you say great bingo? No, this is a losingo sheet. Your trademark event layout for the week. Well, three days, I guess. But now that you mention it, I could have used more color. Sorry, what did you say your name was? Oh, I'm William. Oh, just like the college. Yeah. By the way, I'm Noah. Noah, I know. I see someone studied their faces book. What do you think about my photo? Uh, yeah, sure, but... <sighs> Sweet. Some people thought it was a bit too bold, but, you know, it almost didn't make it in. <gasps> oh! Hi, Josh! Great to have you back! Where else would I be? Beats me. Wait, so what's going on? Oh, there's a meet and greet up on the patio. Uh, you might be a bit early, but I'm sure that there's some people up there you can talk to. No, I mean... I heard that while you were on break, you went up camping. You see any moose up there? I gotta try something first. Noah didn't remember me, that was weird. Well, I could just change community so that he does, right? After all, I am the spirit of community. How did I do this? I think we basically just held hands and closed our eyes, right? Let's see how it goes. Did it work? Nope. <laughs> What's this? Altar broken. Dawns. <laughs> Guess you can say this altar has been altered. <laughs> There's no one here. 
Dawns. Maybe there'll be one at the meeting greet. I guess the altar broke during the last ritual. Why would I make it so that Noah forgot about me? He's one of my closest friends. I wouldn't make a community like that. Unless the lemon slice wasn't enough to remove the binding spell. And the Dark Gravel group still has a pinch of control. They could have influenced the outcomes of the ritual. This community could be a product of both of us. Oh, this isn't good. I don't know it for sure. I need to find out more first. Does that swell me? <laughs> oh, hey, swell me. What are you doing here? Hey, Will. Well, I'm Madame this term. You remember me, huh? I was worried for a sec, because Noah back there completely forgot who I was. I thought I was still under the Dark Gravel group's control. <laughs> uh, dark? The only darkness we have here are their double dark chocolate brownies in the cast. <laughs> well, as a dawn, we have to study the faces book thoroughly. Oh, so you don't remember me. Well, William Luzon, 4B Nanotechnology Engineering from uh, Surrey, BC. Besides what's in the faces book. I was gonna ask, didn't you graduate? How are you a Dawn? <laughs> no, I'm in my 5B term. I don't have to think about graduating yet. 5B, huh? Oh, hey, Fred! So, hey, guys! Didi here? You're living across the hall from me in the Ford Full Along End. Oh, yes, I am so pumped about those Marvel movie nights again. You're living here too? Well, of course. I'm a still, still a student here. I'm in my uh, 81st term. 81st? You didn't graduate? Why would I want to graduate? It's so great here. Oh, hey, Paul, can I get a ride to Broomball? See you guys later. Take care, Fred. Swami, is this common? Oh, yeah. We believe strongly in the mentorship structure here. Though it does mean we get to have uh, four students per room because of the number of students here. Except for us, Dons. Unfortunately, we're still in single rooms. Everyone's in a quad then? Exactly! Look at you picking up the losing lingo. Losing lingo, I like that. Oh, pardon me. Excuse me, someone needs help carrying a couch. I'll see you at the house meeting. We've got something big planned for everyone. And don't forget, at the end of Frost Week, we're taking the open door policy to the next level. Removing all the doors. I'll be there, I guess. You'll be there. Oh wait, Swami, about the altar! He's too far gone. Huh. Oh hey! Watermelon, what? <laughs> Peter, Simon, Nathaniel, Oliver, Simon! I'm so glad I found you guys. The ritual works, can you believe it? Though not completely as intended. Huh. Are we famous for something? Ritual? I don't believe you met. <sighs> Force of habit. Someone must still remember me. Oh, hi, I'm William. Oh, nice to meet you. And these are my roommates and I? Oh, yeah, I already know. Wait, I'm not your roommate? Not unless you want to sleep in a hammock under one of our beds or something. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you said something about a ritual? Oh, well, it's... Are you helping build the dorm tomorrow? They're doing the ritual scene. The dorm? The dorm? You don't know the dorm? It's our very own viral sensation right here out of Luzon. I can't say I have. Dude, you've got to check this out. They invented plane cake. They're literally famous. And, and there's this one where they chuck a ragdoll down the stairs. <laughs> oh, that one's my favorite! It's so good. Can I see that for a sec? Yeah, for sure. The case of the lost losing cards? I mow a how to throw a party? <laughs> These are ideas exactly out of my notebook for my own YouTube videos based on my life. You make YouTube videos too? <laughs> well, yeah, well, no, I've, I've, like, I've had ideas, I've written some notes, but I have pretty bad writer's blocks. I haven't actually done like the idea though. Regardless, the dorm might actually have an idea of who I am and what happened here. Do you know where I can find them? I mean, obviously, the quad. <laughs> <laughs> right, because every room is a quad. Uh, the original, the original. Yeah, yeah, the original, of course. Well, it was nice re-meeting you guys. Uh, yeah, uh, tally ho. Yeah, yeah right. Nice. See ya. What a strange fellow. Tell me about it. <laughs> Huh, it turns out that the original quad was actually here in the apartments. It makes sense given that there's four distinct rooms. Spirit! Oh, oh, oh. oh my gosh! Noah! I'm so sorry! Are you alright? Yeah. Yeah. 
It's okay, I was wearing this <laughs> spooky mask. Why were you wearing that anyways? Oh, it's for this new skit that we've come up with. The Silhouette Committee Strikes Again. Silhouette Committee, not yeah. the Shadow Council? <sighs> Such a good name. <sighs> Should've thought of that. Oh, what about this? The Spooky Commission. That was my idea, I pitched that. It's alright, I guess. Um, anyways, have you, do you know where Keith is? I need to ask him about something. Yeah, he's probably just uh, around here somewhere, uh, getting ready to film uh, our new theme song for Wednesday's talent show. Song? What song? Come on out here, boys! Oh, yeah. We're up in here. Vocalization. Me and the boys. Tight-knit community. Oh, we're the dorm. Donald, Donald, Ronald, and Moe. That spells dorm, we can read, you know. Keith McDonald is the star of the show. My number of subscribers contains eight zeros. I am Arnold and I'm a quote uh, British. I've got an accent because it proves my image. Hi, I'm Ronald and I'm here to say I'm not very special and that's okay. Yeah. My real name's Noah, but there was once a typo. And to M so and now they call me Mo. Introducing Peter, secretary of this place, but you better watch out, cause he's not on the base. <laughs> Ronald, Ronald, and Moe, strutting along together like we're ducklings in a row. We're like the hobbits. From Lord of the Rings, or the two towers twice. Also Lord of the Rings. We're like Abba. We, we can dance, dance we can jive. We're like the Beatles, but we're all still alive. Triplets, no. We are quarter notes. Get your waltzes out of here. We're in 4-4 four, four every time of the year. Donald, Ronald, Ronald, and Moe. We've been living here six terms in a row. Like a fantastic four. There's four of us, like the ghost from Pac-Man. There's four of us, like the eating from eating. There's four, four of us, like three plus one. There's four, four of us, like cardinal direction. There's four of us, like the gospel. There's, There's four, four of us, like algebraic operations. There's four of us, we're the dorm and there's four of us. Donald, Donald, Ronald, and Mo. Now sit tight and enjoy the show. Like these in the pod four. Nah, man. Everyone's welcome in the dorm. Rights reserved. So what brings you here, man? Oh, well, I was introduced to your videos and Ugh. needed to know. Are all these videos based on real events? Nah, man. They just come from this old noggin of mine. Oh. You really thought any of that was real? I mean, it's not that unbelievable. Well, there's uh, mafia and spirits in these videos. I mean, I faced those just the other day. There's one group that wanted to take over community, another one that wants to just destroy it. <laughs> destroy community and lose it? Who would want to do something like that? It's always been so peaceful here. Uh-huh. Okay, well, man, if you ever want to have one of these wacky ideas in one of our videos, just let me know. We'd love to have you on board. Wow. Okay, yeah, I'd love to help out. Oh, I need to figure out what's going on first, though. To start, I thought your name was Keith, but you said in the video that it was Donald? Oh, okay, yeah, so, like, my screen name is Donald. Is Donald, Arnold, Ronald, and Mo. That spells dorm. And, like, the initials do, right? Yeah. And, because my real name, my full name is Keith McDonald, but my full screen name is Donald McKeith. Just for fun. I like that. Like, my name's really Noah, but they called me Moa once on the door sign, so we just shortened it to Mo. Arnold's real name is Arnold, but the characters are quote of British, so everyone thinks it's pronounced Arnold. Okay, so you can do a British accent then. Uh, yep. Um, I just really like the name Ronald. Fair enough. What about you? I've been back for consistently calling you man, my man. What's your name, man? Who's your roommate? Uh, well, I'm William. Like in college. college! Yeah, uh, totally disconnected. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, and I don't know who my roommate is. Well, just check the faces book. It should say it here. Wait, the Facebook book tells you who your roommate is? Of course. That way you can connect with them beforehand and see what you have in common. Huh. That does sound nice. Wait, I thought you memorized that thing. How did you know my name? Oh, um... Oh, well, it says your roommate is... Shayun. Shayun. He was my roommate in first and second year. Oh. There's no way that would make him forget me. Out of all people. Well, it says he lives in the prayer room. Uh, that should be able to give you some more insight. Huh. 
Ah, oh, the prayer room. All right, thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and uh, Will. Yeah. Tonight, remember, there's a house meeting. That'll be important. Don't want to miss that. You gotta be there. All right, I'll be there. Thanks. Oh, um. Why is it so hard for me to get a date? You know what I'm saying? Maybe it's because we call ourselves the Love Me's. It sounds kind of desperate to me. Love me, love me. You mean it's not normal to have seven crushes at one time? Oh, yes. sorry, so sorry. Oh. I, I I thought it would be endearing as a thing, you know, like that Beatles song, "Love Me Do" or or "Love Me Like You Do." You know? You don't know what that second song is about, do you? You know, maybe we should speak to the love rep about like rebranding for the sake of my love life. I think it would be a good conversation. If I'm being honest, I don't think it's our brand that's the issue. <laughs> you're right, you're right. <laughs> Five crushes is a lot more reasonable. <laughs> yeah, and next week we can lower that to three. Ugh, there's literally a sock on the door. You know that that means that I'm in my counseling session. Sorry, Mr. Love Rep, sorry. Uh, you guys are literally my roommates. You can call me by my name. Shayun. We know it, it it just feels weird. Shayun! Whoa! I guess the results from my Phoenix project just came out. Uh please, it was just the algorithm. You don't recognize me either, do you? Wait, you're my roommate. roommate. Yeah. From the basin book, right? Yeah. And these are your two roommates. I call them my love me's. Love me's? Wait, Shayun, are you the love rep here? In the flesh. Huh. The love me nots changed to the love me's. Wait. Love me not. Like juggernaut. Oops. We could wear all black instead, and then we'd be bad. That way I could finally get a date. I hate to break this to you, man. But I don't think that's the problem. Changed. Can we chat for a minute? That's my job. Oh, I mean, yeah. Uh, yeah, let's chat. Please, I like my job. Please. So, what's on your heart? Okay, so this is gonna sound crazy, but just bear with me. Um, if I made community in my image, I'm just confused why I would have made it this way. Mm hmm. Like, everyone pronouncing my name Losin and not Losin. So, so not, not like, like the, the college. college. Well, kinda. And no one remembers me, but they remember each other. And no one graduates. Like, Swomi definitely graduated. Fred Martin definitely graduated. I'm just confused why I would keep them here. So let me get this straight. You're saying that you believe that this isn't the first time that we met? Well, maybe if you guys kiss, you'll get your memories back, right? This isn't some fairy tale. This is real life. It isn't the first time we met. Shane, you and I were roommates for two years. What about us? Oh, well, I knew a version of you guys, but honestly, I've never met you guys before. The Love Me Nuts. Exactly. And so, I just don't know what to do about all of this. Well, why don't you make the most of it? If people forgot who you are, you can re-meet anyone that you want. No hurt feelings, no grudges, no trail of bloodshed. Trail of bloodshed? <laughs> That's a figure of speech, right? I mean, you're not wrong. Wait, what? Oh, sorry, I mean about the re-meeting people. Ah. Nevertheless, I can't understand- like, I didn't consciously choose to have everyone forget me. I'm still convinced the Dark Gravel group had some say in it. Well, it seems you found some peace. If my ability to read time is correct, we have a house meeting now. You have to be there. I was planning on it. You can't miss it! Wasn't going to. You're coming, right? What is up with everyone obsessing over this house meeting? Ah. Come and see.
Apartments are also part of the res? Yep, there's a tunnel on the basement level connecting the two buildings. Great, and that wraps up the house. Coffee houses are just for musical acts? Town shows are for anything. Why don't people graduate? The mentorship program. Oh, um, what happens if you don us? <laughs> Dementors? They're the Dawn Mentors. 
Who said that? That the protectors of this community, that form you saw was some kind of manifestation of their eternal drive to rid this place of any and all dark forces. That's why they threw me in here. But who are you? Take a guess. It's you! Tell me what the Dark Gravel Group did to this place. You must remember something if you had an influence. Dark Gravel Group? Huh. That sounds so familiar, but why? You were the one tormenting me and my roommates. Really? Is that really you? Feels like a light touch if I heard your voice. So, you do remember? Well, bits and pieces. I would have suspected that my being here in this dang prison cell might be came out on top, but seeing you here with me now, I'm beginning to have my doubts. So, you didn't have an influence? Was Oliver right and the lemon slice was enough to remove the binding spell? Just a slice? Well, could be. I can't quite recall. Does this look like your ideal community to you? Well, no. But how is it that you remember anything? Everyone else seems to only know me by the name plastered on the side of the building. William Luzin. They can't even pronounce it right. <laughs> uh, maybe I did have an influence then. That would explain my fragmented memory, or maybe it was just this. The Dons let you keep it? It has no effect on them. I suppose you had something to do with that? Noah? You are the Dark Gravel Group leader? I'm surprised you didn't recognize me, old friend. But I thought we were friends. Before you left, we spent so much time together. You took me in roof running my first time. You helped me on imaginary dates. We even had a mini party. Oh, with all the best foods. Tide Pods, Listerines. We even split a Kit Kat together. Which I broke the wrong way, apparently. And was kicked out of the quad because of it. Dude, you were literally part of the quad for like two seconds. But it hurt for an eternity. I left, and... But after two years of not being with the community, I thought of making my return. But what would even be worth it? Would my friendships have survived? You know what happens to people when they leave Gravel? They become spirits. And then, one of them rose up and convinced the others to finally do something about it, to destroy community. Part of me still had faith, so I fled and rejoined the college. Gravel, you called it, right? I remember Gravel. But truth be told, with all those years, the community remained in my mind. The community itself had forgotten me. That's when I stumbled upon the Dark Gravel group. I put it upon myself to give them direction, to turn Grable back into what it once was, for me. But I shot your ghost to bring you back. I thought we were on good terms. It was a circumstantial pleasantry, but my plan was already in motion. But you seemed so happy when I first saw you. What? When you gave me this. You even pretended not to recognize me. I don't remember doing that. Tell me more about this meeting you met. Well, I met you again after that. This time you were with uh, Keith's dorm, with all the other Dark Gravel group members. That can't be. I, funnily enough, I actually punched you in the face uh, when I saw you wearing that spooky black mask. The one that belonged to the, the Shadow, Shadow Council, Council leader. leader. Exactly. Huh. Seems like when I said a part of me, I was being quite literal. So that means when you return to the community... Another of me stayed behind. ...to lead the spirits to destroy Grable. Perhaps that version of me didn't believe that returning would amount to anything, choosing to believe that if I couldn't be a part of the community... Then no one could. Yet, he doesn't seem to remember our battle? He was just as clueless as the others. Interesting. So there's realistically two possibilities. Either A, I made community in my own image, and so then your ring definitely granted you your memories, or B, it's some kind of hybrid between you and I who made this community, in which case it's either the ring gave you your memories, or you had some kind of influence and you gave yourself the memories. Based on that, I have a good hunch that the ring is, is probably how you got your memories back. Just remember if there were any other relics like this in our past life. Yeah, uh, each member of your crew had one. And have you seen any of them around here now? Um, well, Sebastian, um, he still has a long board. Um, Shayun, who is now the love rat, has Keith's harmonica. 
and I have no clue where the ducky ball that Jaden has is. Oh, that thing has a mind of its own. This would kill me, you know. I tried to perform the summoning ritual prior to you killing Oliver. It was supposed to bring a spirit to the realm of the living, but instead sent me to the realm of the dead. That was the day before you found me haunting your apartment. Turns out that thing needs to be kept in a tight cage. Yesterday I tried to change community so that at least people would remember me. But I found out that the altar was broken. Do you think the items are strong enough to fix it? Sick of your community so soon? I'm being serious. Do you think we can fix the altar to altar community yet? Yeah. I can't say I know for certain, but I'm sure having all of these relics together would bring some light to the situation at hand. Where did you say Sebastian was? Oh, um, he was in the dorm. Get back here. Time for a good old fashioned prison break. What? How? Did it work? Huh. Why would I be so foolish? He's an active community, you hold it. Right. I'm so confused. Let's try this again. Ah! I don't know, it looks like just one guy to me. It's just a bunch of paranormal apparitions. Wait, what? William? Cut. Is it just me or do we have the budget for mirror tricks now? I couldn't tell you. It's me. How did you do that? Who's that with you? Hey Keith, good to see you again. I'd like to introduce you to Noah. That's me. I'm Noah. Wait, Noah, you never told me you had a twin? And one with the same name as you? Let me guess. They're spelled a little bit differently because your parents are so quirky. Oh, what, man? You know I don't have a twin? Who the heck is this guy anyway? Oh, well, long story short, uh, we're two versions of the same person, but we split while passing the void between death and life. Your friends have these wacky stories too? This is absolute gold. Jaden, write this down. Hold on, how do you know this and I don't? Oh, that's another long story. Basically, this ring here, it's imbued with magic, helps me remember, and uh, so is that longboard of yours, Sebastian, so if you don't mind. Speaking of, <laughs> we need that longboard to bring the community back to normal. At least we think. Right? Jaden? Yep, got it, got it. Would you be able to help us out? I'm sorry to tell you, but we need this longboard for our next viral video. Can you find another one? No, nah, it needs to be that one. Okay, I'm sorry to say, but unless you can think of a better viral video idea than planking on a longboard... Which is gonna be sick! Then you can't have it. Just give us a second. Make a viral video? How are we supposed to know it's gonna go viral? <sighs> viral video, viral video. Wait, the dorm invented planking, didn't they? What, just like lying down in weird places? Exactly. Okay. But hear me out. Didn't that go viral in like 2012? Yeah, so? What if all viral trends in this universe are 10 years behind? Hold on one second. You guys heard of the Harlem Shake? Nah. Uh, no. oh. <laughs> well, you were spot on. Okay, so what are you thinking? Cinnamon challenge, ice bucket, mannequin, Tide Pods, you know, leave it to natural selection. <laughs> leave it to me. Okay. Keith? Yeah, man. Roll the cameras. Well, when I'm ready. Come on, let's go. Dude, you don't need to actually go through with this. You know what could go wrong? I know, but there's no room for you. You have to trust me. Sebastian? Already on it. I have a feeling we're not going to need this for a while. Here, take it for however long you need. Thank you. And thank you. We're off to upload this. Take care. Alright, so we got the longboard. What's next? The harmonica, right? Uh, yeah. I think you said it was with the love note? Yeah. Alright. I need to call my grandma. Don't you mean our grandma? We don't know that for sure. We don't know that for sure. The love rep strikes again. Love means art candy to celebrate. Art candy to celebrate. Oh, hey, 
Will. Hey, Shayun. Love these. Love you, William. I'd like to introduce you to Noah here, but not the Noah that you know. Ah, uh, that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> Never mind. Um, we need to borrow that harmonica of yours. The harmonica of love. What? Well, it's not just a normal harmonica. It's the harmonica of love. I mean, sorry, the harmonica of love. Did he just air quotes to love? I think I just saw an air quotes to love. You just air quotes to love, man. What, you don't believe in love? Whoa, whoa calm down. Trudeau. Calm down. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's just slow down, all right? Look, we can't just go giving around the harmonica of love to just anyone. We'll let your air quotes slide, but it's obvious that you don't believe in love, William. Huh. I believe in love. I was the love rep back in my universe. Yeah, and how'd that work out for you? So it's all Will's fault! Ah! The first step towards being open to love is being honest with yourself. Well, I guess I'm a little bit rusty? Okay, fine, I'll admit it. I have no clue what I'm doing. I make it up as I go along and I hope that just works out in the end. What does it even mean to believe in love? That's better. Okay, so how do I believe in love? How do I become worthy to wield the harmonica? Well, if you were the lover, you must have heard of the losing dating chart. Oh yeah, I made one of those. Well, what about it? Well, you got to complete all ten steps. All ten? That'll take weeks. How on earth am I going to find someone that's willing to date me for the sole purpose of getting a magical harmonica? Harmonica of love! You just gotta soften that heart of yours and just let someone in. Let someone in? Wait, from the limited experience that I have, a date is just two people intentionally getting to know each other, spending time with you. Love doesn't have to be romantic, it can be between friends, right? Right, but why do you ask? <laughs> no, it would never work. Come on, Noah, take a chance on me. I didn't think I have to explain this to you. We don't have weeks, we don't have days, we have to do this now. When the dogs go on lockup tonight and realize I'm not in the dungeon, they're gonna come after me. Okay, well then, what do you suggest? I don't know, they're your roommates. Just wipe them off them. No, but that's completely outside of my moral compass. You murdered Oliver. We all draw the line somewhere. Besides, I think we need to do that kind of active community thing to get anyway. Stealing it isn't gonna work. Fine. Well, friendship. Small self personal list. You gotta get matched more than once during Walk of Kilometer, which, according to the time, has just started. Two, we got the lock eyes from separate tables in the cat. Three, games rooms activities. Your choice of pool, 1v1 parrot, or foosball. Losing pressures behind. It's a set in motion by hanging out in the lounge past 10 p.m. It's always past 10 p.m. so <laughs> Five. The classic losing tradition is a bench book. To end up next to each other. Ah! Six. On an intentional walk, your hands gently brush past theirs. Seven. Accidental sleepover. As we are nearing the end of the list, it is about time for your first date. Please take a seat. Thank you. I can't believe step eight of ten is the first date. Classic Grable, or Lowson, I guess. Right? You pronounced my name right. You pronounced mine correctly, it's the least I can do. That means a lot, actually. Especially because you were probably the one that changed it to losing anyways. Yeah, sounds like something I would do. Sorry about that. You're sorry? Pardon my intrusion. Can I get you something to drink? Oh, um, 
I'll just have a glass of water, please. And I'll have what he's having. Ooh. Splendid. You said you were sorry? What happened to that whole reshape gravel in own image mindset? <laughs> You're not pulling smoke up my leg, are you? I don't know, maybe just... The fact that I've lost some of my memories, I feel like a bit of a different person. Do you think that was because you got split into two different people? No. I'm just more full now. Ever since I was coming back to Gravel, I was trying to look for the community that I lost. And I felt lost, and that's what led me to the Dark Gravel group. But now, I think you've begun to show me what community is like again. I have? Wow. So, all that hate and ambition was just because you felt left out? I guess you could say it like that. Can I be honest with you for a second? Of course. When you left Gravel, you didn't lose community. You left community. What do you mean? You left me. We were friends, Noah. You were someone that I could always count on. I might have even called you my best friend. A part of community died for me when you left. Wow. So it was my fault? Did you even try reaching out? I had my reasons for leaving. Maybe I wouldn't have felt so removed if you didn't act like every time one of your friends left Grable, they died. Do you ever think about that? Huh. So, we really dropped the ball, didn't we? Yeah. Yes, we did. Is it too late to try again? Look, I'm not the type to hold grudges, but I do still have some memories in here, and they're not all pretty. Well, the rest of the community seems to have forgotten, and they seem to be doing all right. I don't think it would hurt to try. No. I guess not. So, are we good? Yeah. We're good. Waiter, we'll be having that bill. And we'll be splitting it. 50-50. Oh, water's free. And I haven't even gone it to you yet. Here's a tip. Okay. Well, I would say that was a pretty productive date. I agree. Show you, and if we have two more steps left, then what's the next step? Oh, um, performing the song together. Oh, um, dinner's almost done in the calf. We can still perform there for our live music Friday. <laughs> but William, it's only Tuesday. It's always Friday somewhere. <laughs> but what are we going to perform? We'll make it up as we go. Okay. Step, and that's to be campus hosts. Oh shoot, I forgot about that step. Don't we have to be married to be campus hosts? It takes weeks to find someone to ordain a wedding. Unless you know the right people. My dad's a pastor. Once we found out that we were actually third cousins, he married us on the spot. Here's our campus host application form. What? Oh, um, congratulations to our new campus hosts. Let's commemorate this occasion. Here is the harmonica of love. May its music resonate with your heart's um, was that guy's mouth on that? Well, yeah. No thanks. Uh, I saw him lick the communal salt lamp. That was only once. Well, if they don't want it, I can't leave your effort unrecognized. William, you have proven that you indeed believe in love. And through your brotherly love between each other, I hereby bestow unto you the harmonica of love. We got the harmonica! Awesome! Right. So, what's next? Uh, the ducky ball. Ooh, yes, the darkest relic in our collection. So where would you even find something like that? Mmm, someplace equally as dark. But I don't remember seeing it in the dungeon. You know of any other places that might be dark? I might know someone that can help. Get him! It's okay. 
You can talk to me. Just show me what's in the bag. I thought we wouldn't have to clarify, but we weren't asking. If you're really from student services, you have to show me your badge number. You'd be lucky if we were with student services. Whoa there, bad cop. We need a lighter approach with this one. Like when I softly put this blade to your throat. Fine, fine, geez, I'll talk. Holy crap, William. Yeah, you know, I thought it was a little too much, too. A, a cookie? cookie? Shh, keep it down! What's wrong with cookies here? Well, nothing inherently. They're completely legal. But ever since the community's been cutting back on sugar, Lucent stopped production of all cookies, limiting the supply. And the demand was inflated artificially, just like the artificial sugars you use in the cookies. <laughs> huh. I've been cutting back on sugar. That's pretty admirable. Then who makes the cookies? I don't know for sure, but I've heard rumors that you should check the Great Hall after dark. That's where the supply is managed. It's time for a good old fashioned stakeout. Stakeout! It's about time this dark rebel leader just got a whole lot darker. Did you realize that if you were from this world, you'd be called the dark losing leader, right? <laughs> I've been here for hours. Do you think this will actually amount to anything? Shh! Someone's coming! Wow, it's perfect timing! After me. Go, go, go! What's going on? It's the Italian girl. It looks like they're in charge of this. The Italian pig. Ha 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 Kind of farina. The of flower shortages. Since when can you speak Italian? I learned it from interview. Ah, the piazza. Misericordia. Ah, questo non pensi famiglia. Questo può fare solo mezzo lotto. Questo merita pietà. Nessuna pietà. La famiglia le parlato. Ora il tuo destino. Con il grande e potente Ducky Ball. Ducky Ball, 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 Ducky Bravo, Luca. Linestelli e Canto e Antonia. No. I take it the scouts won't need to make a trip to the dungeons this week, right? Look, this college has a good buffet, but the prison food ain't that great. Cookie goes a long way when compared to sludge. So you were involved with this group? Oh, I didn't know it was run by a secret organization. I bet they didn't tell you that they were in possession of the last relic, too. Naturally not! Preparatori ed esperata! Era del antra impalata! Empalatas? No, no, no! What's gonna happen to her? I can't seem to remember. Like old Kevin Elsie from no, the no, second no, half of the years. No, 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 no,
Speaking of releasing Dark Force, am I right? <laughs> that was me, I did. I released it. You're Dark Force. Inviare una forza oscura per scolpire ogni forza oscura. Ora potrebbe esserci esiste lì sicuramente una distrega da toro e doni saranno soddisfatti. Antonio, you will accompany these uh, fools? Ti stavo da Santo Cato, dalla tua glazia, Cato. If this ball is so dangerous, we could always take it off your hands, you know, assuming we survive. It's only tempted you. Except that offer. Anche se sono in grado di catturare e aumentare, il fatto che ora si libero si porterà a Santa Azione, in tirata che parte di Don, però cose crediamo e queste di Azione lo patrano, lo colpa ricarda su di eh, loro. Ora, è bene, prima che venga in mente un setto inibile. All right, Snoops, get like Basil and Leaf. So where are we supposed to find this duck anyway? Duck. Huh? It's a rubber duck. What's the difference? Well, it's a ducky ball, which is a rubber ducky put inside a bucky ball, which is an arrangement of 60 carbon atoms. But the biggest difference is how duck and ducky are pronounced. How is this at all relevant? Well, where do you find ducks? Duckies. Ducks. The water. Exactly. And where do you find balls? I hope that's a posture of thinking. Sporting events? Two for two. My faccio bene. And where do those two things meet? Water polo. Oh, you were so close. I mean, a cradle. Uh, the volleyball court. Exactly. Oh, we made it. Oh. There it is. Quick, go right. Oh, go left. Where do I go? Go forward. Okay. Ow. Oh. <laughs> All this missing is to me. I will be able to get one and three dead to put this back in this game. It's flying! I got it! I got it! I got it! That's a log. We've been deceived. Where'd it go? Oblivion oh, broadcast. No, it's going to bike storage. I only have a bike storage key and not a hockey storage key. We have to catch it fast. Let's go! I'm sure I'll know once I've pulled it all of them. How do we know it. it's gonna work? We don't, but uh, let's find out, shall we? Okay. Let's start to go back to my long 
board. The catalyst of velocity. I can feel it accelerating the energy around me. The harmonica of love, the heart, the soul, the spirit. The ducky ball, the caged demon, the line to bridge both life and death. And finally, the ring. My signet to stamp the manifestation. Noah, the altar is still broken. What did you do? I, I remember. <laughs> what? Grable, the dark Grable group. You. Noah. Shadow Council, Spirit of Nature, the ritual. It's all coming back. Noah, talk to me. <laughs> I, I remember everything. Uh, I know how to fix it. Quick, put all the items around the altar. We can get the community back to how it's supposed to be. Willie? Really? What the ducky ball said earlier was right. What? This is my idealized form of community. You didn't have an influence at all. Okay, so the lemon slice worked. Yeah, I, I remember that now. Come on, can we do this? No, don't, don't play me like that. This is your plan all along, wasn't it? You never said that you wanted to fix the altar. What are you talking about? I underestimated how much my subconscious had a say in the matter. Wow. No. <laughs> Hear me out. You manipulated me. You played me. Huh, I thought I was regaining a long lost friend. How can I be so fickle? We're so close now, William. Come on. No, no, stop, stop. You're ripping off a scab that just started to heal. I'm done. I can't do this anymore, Noah. Oh, come on. William, what are you doing? Hello? There's a dark force here trying to take over community. Dang it, Will. We had it in the bag. This was going to work. We were so close. What are you doing? No! Everything. Since last million. night. 30 million? Check it out. With an M? We're working on the script for the next skit after lunch. Be there or be there. Wow, okay, yeah, I will. Thanks. Okay. Hey, oh. uh, Will, you're in there, right? Yeah. Yeah, we got class now. We gotta go. Oh, shoot. Uh, I gotta grab my coat. Okay. So, how have you been settling into Lucen so far? Like, being honest, the last few days were kind of rough, but mm. things are starting to look up. Oh, that's really good to hear. I mean, for me, the last few days have been perfect. What class do we have? Uh, it's any 6 microcomputation for photonic Simon. devices. Yeah, what? Simon! Simon! Professor, is that subscript an M or an N? Oh, got it, thanks. I can't believe they didn't tell us the tutorial was cancelled. Oh, I woke up early for nothing. Oh, hey, well. Something is wrong.
epic! I was flipping bottles before it was cool. As if. I haven't seen my family four years. I haven't seen mine in three. I haven't seen my family in five years. If people can't leave, they can't see their families. For God so loved the world Deco that he like gave channel. us only one and only son that whoever believed in him shall not go into high eternal life. This will never end. If you don't send this to Bud, you'll be able to get Bud. Did you ever do your best in this group? Why do you order Bud? I can literally do this. That's not a beverage pack. Leak this video now. No, it's the way it is. But I can't believe that I don't have to pay back my student loans. It's great. I can't believe I ran up $430,000 of student debt. That's like the tuition of a foreign student. Something is really wrong. As you guys trickle in, there is iced tea on the table if you want any, and we're about to get started. <clears throat> Hi. You may be wondering why I gathered you here today. You're getting married? Uh, do you have more ideas for videos? Aspetta. Noi si è morto? No, no, and not anymore. What? Let me be the first to tell you that this community is not perfect. What? What's what that supposed to mean? But the Don told us it was that the house. Oh, see. see, this is what I'm talking about. You've all been brainwashed to believe that you're living in the Garden of Eden, but you're actually living at Laurier. Huh? No. Just look around. People don't graduate. People can't leave. And if you break a single rule, you get thrown in a dark, dank prison. Wait, what's wrong with prison? It had a door. It was closed and locked. <laughs> okay, everyone, sit down, sit down. You too. Me too, me too. So what are you gonna do about it? I'm glad you... asked. So we need to reclaim the items of power that the Dons hid somewhere, release Noah from prison, then finally perform the ritual to change the community back to normal. Any questions? Um, I'm still confused how the Dark Table was a friend for the Dark Gravel group. Here. Oh, oh I see, that makes sense. If there aren't any questions, let me be the first to declare the Great Belly. Yeah! Each gonna split up into teams to find each of the items of power. Alright, let's go. They gotta take my community away from me. No, are you bummer? Yeah. Okay, so tell me why we thought that the items might be in the kitchenette? I didn't. There's just sometimes food there for associates. Wait, what's an associate? Oh my goodness! Are those the tr items there in the trailer area? No, there! Good eye, mate! Go, 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 go! Wait a minute. Why would they just hide the items in here? This is not a very good place to hide them. Well, maybe they were sure inside because they had glasses. We couldn't think of where to put them. You take these down to the altar. Go, 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 go. Text the group. Let them know that we're on our way. Yeah, man. Alrighty boys, let's go! Wait. No? Oh, Rick. Three and two out. Oh, no. You can't leave me behind. Jaden! Come back! It's gotta be me, man. Keep the channel alive. Don't ever stop streaming. I never do. <laughs> Ask in the chat, boys. Right on time. I'm here to break you out! William? Oh. Oh. I'm sorry, I was stupid. I was wrong. 
and I really need to work on my listening skills. Well, look who finally came to their senses. <sighs> Can you find it in yourself to forgive me? Look, man, community isn't that fragile. You're the spirit of community. So, what do you got in mind? All right, just poke this and let's get to the altar. Dude, they took my ring. I can't do that. What? What are we going to do? Excuse me. We are enacting the permanent open door policy today, and this door is clearly in violation of existing. Please stand back. show tonight? The campfire event isn't until tomorrow. What are you doing with all those bygone relics? I could have sworn we hid them all now. Were we followed? You're not trying to abandon this community you made, are you? It's in the dawns! Isn't this what you wanted, William? What? Your community was fading. You weren't as tightly knit. The fear that you're hiding. Why don't you show it? What you wanted when you fought the masquerade? Isn't this what you wanted? Isn't this what you made? You knew about the dark forces? Yes, and as far as we're concerned, there's only one left. I'm talking about you, bud. I served my time. It doesn't have to be this way, though. It's all right. You can stay here. Leave your past behind. You're alone. Now look at the community you have. You know, maybe I was alone. Maybe I needed the attention. Maybe I was so scared to graduate because I was worried that this is the only chance at community I'd get. Just like someone else I know. That's, you can't just find community by being there. That's not how community works. It truly is unfortunate that we couldn't convince you. You know, I'm quite fond of this community you made, William. I finally found my place. Mo, oh, my man, what are you doing? Sorry, Keith, but I'm not ready to give up on this community. I'm not giving up everything. Johns, let's finally take care of these dark forces. No! We're the great battle! Shayu, no! You saved me! You can't be gone, you can't be gone! I've never slept outside before. <laughs> Wait. What's this? A what card? Oh, that's convenient. <laughs> wow. I forgot that when I made this place, Simon wished that roommates can't die. Which means they were all saved. Not everyone. The Dons don't have roommates. Se pata que curso significa. Okay, well, we're not killing anyone else. Oh, wow, you've come so far. Camia tuto. How are we supposed to beat them and get to the altar? Will, you, you're the spirit of community. Do something. <sighs> I know we need to get the relics to that altar. Okay, everyone, take the altar and distract the dawns. Noah, we need to get your ring back. Let's go. So, so time, time in. in. Time in. There is one way. No. Hey, Sugar Plum Fairy. It's ironic, isn't it? Before you wanted to destroy community, but now you want to keep it? Well, you wanted to change community before, and now you still do. Learn some character growth. I thought we were supposed to be an author or something. Look, I can see you're in pain. Community hurt you, and it hurt me too. Yeah? So? But this isn't our real community. It's so perfect. I know. It'll be just like waking up from a good dream. How do I know that when I wake up, 
the community will still accept me for who I am. We don't. But it's the risk we're gonna have to take to give these people their lives back. Community takes work, but I'll be with you every step of the way. You promise? Always. The whole is better than the sum of the parts. you? More than ever. No, no, no! This isn't how it's supposed to be! This community is perfect, and you're not gonna take it from us! Oh, jeez, Will, what are we gonna do? We're royal screwed. I realize now that the biggest problem with this community is that it was made up by one person. I cast all my fears, my anxieties, onto all of you. And I told you that it was perfect. That's not right. I need to right this wrong, Noah. I hereby bestow the spirit of community onto everyone. Now! on the patio, sit down for a meeting with the love rep, host your own social event, reach level three on the Grable dating chart, <laughs> do an act of community. I got bingo! Bingo!
my community has finally been saved. Conrad Grable University College is right back where it was, and William and Noah are now sufficient with what they've done, and are happy to graduate and see what the future of life holds for them. And I guess now that we all have the spirit of community in us, uh, I'm kind of the spirit of like two things, which uh, I think that makes me kind of special, so um, we'll see where that leads off. Until next time. Thank <laughs> you.